right guys, so it has been a little bit since I have done an update. We are down in San Diego. It got cold. I'm just gonna say that. It got it got chilly. I am on the hunt for a co-working space. Uh, this pandemic is really making it hard for me to go in and work places. As normally I would go into coffee shops or libraries. Those are not currently an option right now. So I've even been having to go to like a park bathroom to see if there's outlets. I've been trying to find like places to charge my computer because the work that I do takes a lot of power for my laptop and my solar only gets so far. I toured one yesterday uh, in downtown San Diego called Downtown Works and I'm going there tomorrow to do a trial day. So I'm gonna take you guys along with me to show you what that looks like. And so today I'm going to their second location in Carlsbad, which I'm going to also tour and uh, try to work out of today. I wanted to show you this real side as well, living on the road and working remotely during this pandemic, what I am having to go through right now in order to continue my growth of my brands. So let's do it. So I am in one of the little phone booths that you can come into to take a call. About to hop on a client call here in a couple minutes, but I wanted to show you that this is part of the space. Pretty pumped. Also, the free coffee is really, really good. Hot, but good. For the brand film, I think I think it'd be good to have kind of an overall theme and message, something we can kind of keep tying back to. First one I put down is honoring the past while promoting like the future. Cause you guys just moved, but we don't want to forget like your foundation. Back in the car. And uh, from the photos, it looked a lot smaller and it's pretty open and it wasn't very busy at all. A lot of space, it was really quiet. Um, I really liked the layout more than I thought. And uh, my mind may be changed because things that this place, this location has that the one we go to tomorrow does not. Free parking, giant parking lot that is free. Uh, downtown San Diego does not have that uh, without a 15 minute walk or something. and. This place is for sure dog friendly. I think the other place is too, but there is like a big yard in the back that she said I can let him run around in and he can come in. And here's the cherry on top that I did not expect to be open, but they do have showers. She showed me they have these like sep like big private showers, it's basically a bathroom, but it's like a shower um, and they are open even though COVID is a thing. And some, even gyms, some of the showers aren't open. So that's uh, kind of a look at location number one. It's Tuesday, what is it? Today? Yeah, Tuesday, tomorrow, Wednesday, we'll be downtown San Diego to check out Downtown Works in San Diego. San, Di San Diego. I won't finish that quote from Anchorman, but there you go. For those that do know what I was about to say. Kudos. We are across from San Diego downtown. About to hop on the ferry to get over to the city to work. I've dropped Sam off at the sitter. Let's go check out this second workspace. wondering why I took a ferry it's because uh, the dog sitter for Sam is actually on Coronado Island and I found out there's a free 
uh, commuter ferry before a certain time in the morning um, that people can commute back and forth and you get a free return trip back in the afternoon. So this is about a 10 minute walk over to the uh, workspace. So let's check it out. As you can see, we're downtown San Diego, but this is cool, we're at the Broadway Pier. to come up here and get some sun uh, so pretty much if you're a member with them you can go to any of the locations which is super cool because it's kind of identical pricing and everything um, not sure if I said that yesterday or not but yeah so this is by far my favorite of all the ones that I've kind of looked at the other ones didn't have what I needed with like being pet friendly and uh, you know kind of having a decent rate under a certain amount so this is like $2.95 a month if you're going the monthly unlimited route, which basically means 24-7 access. You can do like a day pass bundle or something like that. I think $185 for 10 days, but only during business hours, 8 to 6. I've already gotten a lot done today. I worked for a good few hours and it's just kind of nice for a change to actually have a proper workspace and desk. Everybody around is hard at work, so you just kind of are in that rhythm, that groove. So less distractions and you just kind of want to work more um and it feels good it feels good so all right guys so i just left the downtown works i wanted to quickly touch on why i'm doing this in the first place i have a good two three weeks full weeks of work that i need to be doing and because of covid i I'm unable to really charge my computer up in any locations like coffee shops and libraries and stuff. So it's gotten so bad that like literally nowhere is open to do that. So these co-working spaces are kind of like my last resort uh, for me to have like a remote working setup. Um, and for, for not too much of an investment really because what I was having to do was uh, get a hotel room not for a bed not for a shower but solely because I needed a place to charge my stuff and my laptop and work so that is why I'm doing this really good uh, day of work it's only almost three but the ferry leaves uh, top of the hour every hour so I wanted to catch the three o'clock ferry back to Coronado Island pick up my dog and meet up with a buddy of mine down in Ocean Beach and just kind of hang out for the rest of the day. Uh, Alright guys, we made it back to Ocean Beach. One of my favorite places in this whole place, in this whole town, Ocean Beach and Sunset Cliffs. It's just like no other. Um, and here, I'll show you why right now. This is why it's my favorite place. 